Hi everybody, my name is Scott Walls. I am the source to settle and OBN expert here at Panamere. For over 25 years, I've deployed ERP applications for some of the world's largest organizations. You're watching an application overview video. In this video, I provide an overview of Oracle Cloud's negotiation application. This application is part of the procurement functional area. Click the link above to watch a quick video explaining the procurement functional area. I will use the following five slides to explain this application. What is a negotiation? Common business examples? Who creates negotiations? How they are created? And when they are created? But best of all, I'm going to do it in less than five minutes. So let's get started. Slide one, what is a negotiation? As you can see in the diagram, a negotiation is a broader term for the sourcing, deliverables, and contracting process all working together. Click the link above to watch a quick video explaining the contracts application. Slide two, common business examples. Here are the most common types of negotiation, also known as sourcing events and procurement. Request for information. So this is pre-source. I need to get some details in order to understand how or if to set up a sourcing event. Request for quote. This is simply how much. Here we have a request for proposal. So I might use an RFI to get some information to create an RFP because I don't know what to do as opposed to, I know what I want. I just need to know how much, which is my RFQ. Now we use something a little bit more complex, a non-competitive or sole source justification. So here I'm just worried about the structure of the deal and more particularly, I wanna make sure that I marry up the contractual requirements to what's being asked inside of my negotiation or sourcing event. Next, we have a buy auction. So here I'm gonna offer up the demand, 500 laptops, and I'm gonna have everybody compete on price and I'm gonna force time to get the best price. The flip of that is I'm not giving you demand. I'm gonna sell you back the, uh, the items I bought, the laptops, now I'm going to sell on price and again, use time as my weapon. Pro tip, not all negotiations are competitive like we talked about up earlier. Non-competitive events can be linked to contract types to ensure all criteria for that contract type are being met for a given purchase. Also, negotiated contract spend is central to the value of procurement cloud. So click on the link above to watch a quick video explaining how to create value using Procurement Cloud. Slide three, who creates negotiations? The initiators of negotiation or sourcing events are as follows. Requesters, buyers, category managers, or in this case for a sell auction surplus property. Slide four, how are they created? Every organization negotiates differently, but this slide walks us through the negotiating or negotiation creation process. First, internal groups define the purchase and the supplier selection criteria. Second, they select the style. These are typically configured options that are based on how that organization purchases. So they may say goods versus service. They may all, as they do in this, focus on industry or verticalized purchase options. Third, optionally, the sourcing team can simply rerun a prior event saved as a template. Fourth, after defining the items to be purchased and the suppliers to bid, that particular event is published, meaning we let everybody know. Fifth, bidders respond. Sixth, the sourcing team manages and stewards those responses and the process in general to a completion or close. Seventh, optionally, and this is something really nice about Oracle Cloud that we haven't seen in past applications or I haven't seen in any other application between the integration, like we said in the first slide, between negotiations and contracts. Optionally, the sourcing team can author and execute the contract prior to finishing the award, right? So if I can't get the contract and I did that after the award, I might have some egg. And then obviously then the eighth and final step is the completion of the negotiation and award to agreement or purchase order. Click the link above showing how to create a negotiation. And lastly, slide number five, when are negotiations created? Let's walk through the procurement process in two simple steps. Step one, 
purchasing services are performed, and if no catalog item is found, meaning pre-negotiated content, the sourcing services are performed. As you can see in the slide, negotiations are the third step in the sourcing services. Click the link above to watch a quick video explaining the procurement process, but in much more detail than this. Okay, this is the end of this video presentation, but hopefully it's just the beginning of your Panamere journey. Did you know that there are thousands of free videos just like this one on Panamere.com and hundreds more on Panamere's YouTube channel? In fact, if you're watching this on YouTube, please don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Remember, better content, better skills, better income, better life. Panamere wants to help you get 1% better every day. Thank you for watching and have a great day.